What's up guys, main man Sui here, hoping you're all doing awesome as always, we're all in the big old waiting room for Tekken 8, well at least we have cross play, lay, cross play, that's the best joke in this video, but so we're gonna watch Pang's uh, new video and it's called the average lay wulong experience, and this guy is kind of a uh, genius, he's made some amazing videos, uh, and I'm sure this one is going to be incredible as well, so let's just get into it. <laughs> Let's go. Sorry for pausing, but will he be in Tekken 8? I'm, I'm so sorry, but I, I say hell no. I'm one of the people who really don't want to see that guy in Tekken 8 because he's so annoying to play against. And no one plays him. No one plays him. He was not going to be in Tekken 7. But the fact that he wasn't in the character select screen creates a gigantic uproar and they add him in season 2. I, I just find it so dumb. No, literally no one plays that guy. Like Harada stressed it a million times. No one plays him. But for some reason people are like, but he should be there. When I, when I pick my character, like be it Brian, Jin or whatever, Leroy, I want Lei to be visible on the character select screen. Like, all of those resources, like, they're creating characters from scratch for Tekken 8. It's super expensive. Murray told me it's like a million dollars per character. It's, it's like obscene amounts of money. And are, are we going to put all of those resources into that? The super obnoxious character that no one plays? Or are we going to put all of those resources into Marduk? You know we should do the latter. A <laughs> first person is so good. Oh no! <laughs> His use of camera angles, I mean... Christopher Nolan? Is this Oppenheimer? I hate this character. The first person is so good. He got me now. Or does he? Best flow chart in the game, by the way. Probably after Jan's forward four. Is now low parry. Yeah, you couldn't low parry that in tag two. So cancer. Oh my god, I, I love this man. Naked gun. Oh, and that's against the reverse ruler. I, I just, I just have to stress how much is it still amazes me. You know, watching this and playing lay myself once in a while, getting Tekken God in like two days. I just remember how for the longest time in this community, Lei was known as like the fucking Gandalf of characters. Like mastering him, like, oh god! Do you have 18 years on your hands to master Lei? Like, all of the Lei play because, because the entire community just trusted the Lei players. Because no one plays this character, so everyone was like, hey, Lei community, how hard is he? Uh, hardest in the game, by far. Take, take Kazuya and multiply by five. That's how hard Lei is. And then I pick up Lei and it's like, spam a couple of strings and like smoke everyone. It's... Ooh. 
But you, you can't trust, uh, most players will say that their main is difficult, that's just how it works. Oops. <laughs> Gordon Ramsay. Nice evasion. <laughs> nice cock model. Fuck. Oh! Did he just take a rocket to the dick? Did you make me Canadian? He made me Canadian. I'm not your buddy, friend. I'm not your buddy, guy. What? You. I mean, I'm white trash, but I'm not that white trash. Not yet. You are not good enough. <laughs> <laughs> My brain is in a constant state of distress. The fuck. Is this Joker too? Joaquin Phoenix? Oh god, how embarrassing. Say hello, brother. But honestly, just just flush this character down the fucking toilet, Bananamko. Good enough. What are you aiming at? Slide to the right. Slide in the I just feel for these players. What are you doing? Problem with me is I have empathy. Like when I smoke people with Marduk, I actually feel for, for my opponent. So I, I feel bad for these guys you know, having to go up against Lei. <laughs> okay, that was a sick edit. Just Kuma things. Fight. Oh. <laughs> I've never done that flowchart. I mean, that, that's basically how Lei players, Xiaoyu players, and Yoshi players play. They go on to Discord to their tiny communities and say, what flowchart are you guys using? I do forward 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 into stance 2. It always works. And then no one knows this matchup. So all you need are these flowcharts. Oh, this flowchart didn't work. Backup flowchart number B52. <laughs> Death combo. That's how it works. They don't lab other characters. They just lab their own character. Can you imagine playing a character like that? I mean, all you do is labbing your own character. You don't even have to look at your opponent. Ooh, naked Chloe? Oh, sick at it.
Always fucking up my order, bro. I asked for Lei Wulong. They gave me clown. <laughs> oh, nice mod. Sin City was made. Unfortunately, Sick. mediocre hitbox, which means it is prone to whip sometimes. But honestly, how many rage arts are messed up by the wall? I think I think King's has to be the worst. If I'm playing King and I've got my back towards the wall, I know full well I don't have a rage art. I just don't have one, because for some reason, when they press into you when you're at the wall, King will always whip. He will always whip. You don't have a rage art. It's so frustrating. Not this time. <laughs> Fair enough. <laughs> it's so shit. Change side, you fool. Why could a reach art in there? I like this mod, though. <laughs> it's when you get to be legitimately violent against women. It's one of the joys in life. <laughs> what the fuck is this? What is this sexism? Don't care. Booty? Please! <laughs> but holy shit, the amount of time that goes into these edits. If you've ever done a little bit of editing yourself, you can imagine how long it takes. Just the work hours assembling your ideas here for n almost nine minutes and that's not taking into account like brainstorming all of these funny edits moments and memes it's like and you know all of these angles he's using the the mods he's using to control the camera you know and capture all of these sequences Like the insane amount of time that must go into this. So yeah, Pang, uh, Pang if I may speak for the community, like uh, 11 out of 10. Uh, every single vi video is a fucking knockout. Like uh, absolutely amazing uh, masterpieces. Uh, your devotion to your craft is very inspirational. And uh, I, again, like I really hope we get to see more of this. And uh, with Tekken 8... Uh, and the mods that probably will be in Tekken 8, you guys will be able to make such amazing videos. Um, but, like, uh, it's just so good, like, my jaw drops during these videos. The amount of hours you put in, uh, but just how solid the editing is and how amazing your ideas are. These, you know, uh, goof goofy, funny moments and the camera work. Uh, so super, super well done. Uh, bravo, sir. And I really hope you keep it up. Um... Uh.